Hello YouTube, this is Dragonheart and welcome to my YouTube channel. Welcome to my legendary campaign for Sparta. This is Total War Steam Achievement Attempt and we are down to our final settlement, Athens. We have one army, the Defenders of Olympus and the game is lagging a little bit. <laughs> it's not a good start. Right, we are replenishing from last time. If you remember, I, I do apologise again, in the last episode of this campaign, um, ooh, authority food defense we will go with an army authority in the last episode of this campaign we were defending Athens against Macedon and the AI really wound me up the, the siege AI was terrible we had situations where there were three ladders going up and the general was going up the one ladder and the other two units weren't going up the, other, the ladder and there's so much you know so if you want to see a bad AI go and look at my previous episode of this let's play but enough about that episode, we're going to continue with this campaign and I got a decision to make, I got to replenish, I've got to try to need to recruit some more units actually, so what we got, we have Spartan Hoplites, I have my general who's a royal Spartan, we have Perioikoi Hoplite, Perioikoi Spears, Peltas and Slingers, um, probably a few more units of infantry, I like the Spartan Hoplites, like a look at these, only 85 upkeep as well, so two of them and Citizen cavalry. We are short of cavalry in this army. Two more units of cavalry. It'll take two turns, but we need this desperately. Our technology tree at the moment. What are we recruiting? Uh, researching. Agent recruitment cost minus three percent recruitment cost for all army units or provinces. That'll be interesting. So Hellenization we'll go for in our research. Diplomacy. We are at war with everybody, as you would expect in this kind of Commander. thing. Can I upgrade? Oh, I can actually. Shrine, Shrine of Poseidon it can be a temple of Poseidon. That will help with food and we get level 2 ship hull. So we'll go with that and that should help out. We are minus 25 public order but we do have 2 plus 2 green so that should uh, help out. Ready for orders. Um, I got a decision to make. Look at this. Look at Tylus. They've taken Pela and Clarissa. Uh, you, you do sense that it could be a matter of time before they come to an, and attack me. But I'm going to end the turn there because there's not much I, else I can do in this turn. I only have the one settlement and the one army to manage at the moment anyway. And the game is lagging a little bit. I have actually... I actually do have to thank Lionheart for this because I do have him as a friend on Steam. And he has the same processor and the same graphics card as me. And on, on his Steam profile, he's got a screenshot of the settings he uses to record. So I've actually gone back into his uh, onto his photo in, in Steam, looked at the settings he's been using, and I've actually tried to adapt them to my own recording settings. Because I have noticed in the last few battles that the game has lagged, and oh my god, <laughs> this could be the end of the campaign right here. Look at this, 965 plus 302 reinforcing against 1,847 does not look good indeed look at the oh my god right we'll assault we will control the large army we'll see what the performance is like now in this battle but just to warn you guys this could end up being the last battle especially if i lose look at my units they're very very depleted although there is hope because this is the cji after all which didn't do too well in the last battle and i did have a bit of a rant um i'm still feeling the effects of that rant now actually <laughs> I think I think after I recorded that episode, I went straight and had a drink because <laughs> it was that bad. But yeah, um, it's no surprise really. We know that the CJI isn't that good in in this game at the moment. I do hope that with a bit more patching, it will improve. But um, yeah, I literally I had the same sort of army now, which I have depleted units. I just throw in them at the gates, and the AI just was so passive, was putting ladders up, not using them was walking all the way around the city it was it was stupid it really was it was you know all the total war games have better ai than that and it looks like our enemies are over here which is good so what we shall do it looks like they'll probably attack this gate i imagine we will get all our missile troops we will stick them all on the wall try to get some sort of uh, order with these units like so it's two over there slingers try and get as many units 
uh, available to fire as possible. So in a long line like so, it should be beneficial for us. Sparta! And we should put this unit like so, in one long line. Thinning the lines, giving them a less of a target to hit, plus more units to fire in one go. So that's my my peltas. I'm going to put them on off skirmish as well. I want to keep them there firing. We have so many depleted units. Right, I need my strongest units now in the center by this gate. Like so, I will probably put these units into phalanx. This one can be at the gate. I'm not going to zoom in much in this battle as well because the game has lagged quite a bit for me recently when I've done that in, in recording. When I'm in doing just playing the game myself, it hasn't been too bad, but when I act actually do record, it can be quite unbearable. Especially one of my Carthaginian parts was terrible recently, so I'm just going to be a bit, um, a bit weary of that at the moment, see if I can get a better performance somehow. And what else we got left? We've got all these crappy units now, which which don't have much chance. We'll just stick them here. There we go. So we have three capture points in Athens. Can't use the map, of course. We don't have any reinforcements. My general's given a speech. I'll let him get on with it. Here you go with the ladders. Now, it'll be interesting to see whether the AI actually uses... Um, these ladders, whether they will actually put the four of them up against the wall and use all four, or whether they will just climb up one ladder and leave the others at the at the gate. So that's something to look out for. Oh, we do have ships. That's a fail. Where are they? Over here. The AI I don't believe has any ships or anything, so I'm just going to disembark them, march them up to the wall as quickly as, as possible. Let's get myself with the... There they are, over there. <laughs> Couldn't find my units then, right, so... Uh, I'm gonna speed this up because this is kind of boring at the moment. See what they do. Just hold a defensive position. See what the AI does. And hopefully we can push them back. But if we lose this city, this will probably be the end of this campaign. But I don't mind, you know, it has been an enjoyable experience. And I do hope that some of you guys have enjoyed this because... I don't play on legendary usually. I don't <laughs> I don't take up challenges like this. Like the this is total war achievement, so it's all you know, it's all for a good a good laugh really. That's why I've done it. Something different for my channel and I will replace this let's play once it's ended anyway with with a new let's play. I am thinking of perhaps Shogun 2 or maybe Medieval 2. Because I've already got my Carthage campaign and I've also got my co-op campaign. So there's plenty of Rome content on my channel. And here we go. We're firing down upon the enemy. And they are losing many men. Look at this. We're absolutely destroying this unit. They're not, they're not going to make it to the wall, surely. They're going to start routing before long. Down to 70. 68. 60. Oh my god. They're going to get completely butchered. Looks like I've done the right thing with putting them in thin lines. They are going to get up, but they're, they're going to be depleted nonetheless. They are getting up the walls up here, but I want to see what happens, whether they decide to actually attack or whether they go back down the ladders. I'm not going to respond oh, on this unit, where are they? 32, 31, and they're shaking, that's good. So yeah, I do apologize, I'm not going to zoom in much in this battle, but I want to see what happens. And looks like this unit, look at this, they haven't gone up the ladder. This unit of Levy Freeman hasn't gone up the ladder. This one... Uh, where'd they go? Oh, they're there, right. So we've got some targets to hit. These guys can go for the kill. They're depleted units, but they should be enough to take out the Spear Warriors, you would think, anyway. Put Rapid Advance on for a couple of them as well. Get them into the fight quickly. I'm just hoping this battle doesn't... doesn't lag on like some of my other siege battles on my Sparta Let's Play. Here we go, we're crashing into the Spear Warriors now. What's happening? What is happening? They're all running off for some reason. Where are you going, men? Where are they going? Right, I'm going to put this back to normal speed because I've been speeding up for quite a bit. I don't know what is going on here, but for some reason they're deciding to run over there. I think it's because they, their unit has glitched. Let me see. 74. I don't know if they've glitched or not. Can't really tell. I'm going to just, just going to move my men to them. They should hopefully uh, 
kill some of them. For some reason, when I click the attack button, they run off in that direction. It must be a glitch with their unit, but we'll take them out nonetheless. I have no scruples over taking out the AI in such deceiving manners. This unit is getting butchered by my arrow tower and some of my skirmishers. They are down to 94. 91? Oh, we're doing well. We are doing well indeed. This unit is also getting peppered by plenty of missiles with my skirmishers and my tower as well. Uh, what else they got? They have skir plenty of skirmishers, Thracian warriors, quite a few Thracian warriors. Yeah, I think we, we might be able to win this. Depends really. They do outnumber me and I have got many units which are depleted so... Oh, look at this. They are doing what the AI does best. Bring torches to a siege battle which already has four ladders up on the siege wall. And that is fantastic to see. Nice to see the AI using... Using? <laughs> I've just turned... Just turned Japanese. Using? Um, the AI actually using... It's... Uh, it's initiative with the walls. And it's getting beaten back. They waver in. They're going to break soon. Their spear warriors are going to be defeated here. You would imagine as well. They are outnumbered by my depleted troops. I do have these skirmishes over here. Which I should probably bring up because I just forgot about them. Let's bring them to there just for now. Oh, and look, look at how many men they've brought. Look at these slingers. They have so many bowmen and slingers. Uh, it's a good thing that the siege towers have no ammunition. At least I don't think they do. Let me know in the comments if they do. But I doubt they do. I think it's just unlimited. So you control the tower. You just fire away. Uh, we've beaten this unit back. This unit is just taking fire from the tower and not doing nothing. Oh my god. Just standing there. This is embarrassing. This is legendary difficulty. You know what? Dragonheart, calm down. This is YouTube. This is your let's play. Don't let the bad AI, CJI, let, let me ruin this for you guys. It's there for you all to see. This unit has been defeated by the Arrow Tower. These units have defeated this unit down here. So they can come back. They can go to about here. Plenty of units. Oh, and I've actually... What the nerf? I just lost a unit of skirmish for some reason. Wasn't paying attention. Whoopsie. Gonna get some shots away though. We are slowly taking out their units. Still got loads of skirmishers on the walls. What are the ammunition like? Uh, we've got about half ammunition left. Good, good. What else do they have? They have... <laughs> they have ballista. They have ballista. Oh my god. I didn't know they had ballista. There it is. Dacian ballistas. Which will cause a dent in my walls or my... Or my uh, entrance to my settlement if I'm not careful. They, they get bringing all the skirmishes forward. Oh, look at this. You know what? I'm going to try to counteract this by spamming my way in with all my... Uh, what have I got? What can go to Phalanx? This can go to Phalanx. You guys can can come back for there. Stick you in the old Phalanx as well. I'm going to do this with as many units as possible. I don't want them to spam in. For some reason I can't get this turn. There we go. That's better. Much better. And I have some more Phalanx formation type units. Spearmen and etc. Some of these. Nope, nope. Yep, yeah, these can. Phalanx it is. This is your typical hoplite defense of Athens type of battle where you put everything against the gate because that's where they're going to burn down and try to get through and you're going to use your uh, bring these uh, bring these javelin men up to the wall you're going to use your spearmen and your phalanxes to defend the gate here but they will blob through. I'm not going to zoom in I zoomed in in the Carthage, uh, Siege of Carthage in my Carthage Let's Play and oh my god, I wish I hadn't bothered. I spent tw about 20 minutes of the game just lagging on me. Um, so yeah, I'd rather not do that. I'm just going to keep this my distance, I'll explain to you guys what's happening. But I'm too scared with the recording at the moment. They've burnt the gate down. The only problem is that they got so many skirmishes they can just skirmish me to death. But if I stay behind the walls I should be relatively safe. We still firing upon them, and we still got our tower as well. So things are going okay, I think. Um, what else? They do have no. They don't have any reinforcements, do they? I'm gonna just double check my city in case, because they, they've picked foggy conditions as well. That doesn't help the recording. It happened before. They picked rain, and the game just completely spazzed out on me. It was not a pretty sight, not indeed. 
and my Welsh accent is probably irritating a lot of English people at the moment, so I do apologise, but what can you do? Right, um, it doesn't look like there's any reinforcements, so this is the main army here. Plenty of shots away. This unit of slingers is all out of ammunition. They can come down here. At the double! At the double. Balhamun be praised. Oh wait, wrong campaign. <laughs> Oh, look at this. The Thracian warriors are throwing themselves in. <laughs> Four of them are going to run at me through the gate. Four of them have run at me through the gate and then survive. It's what we do. It's what we do. Oh, look at all these slings. It's like rain. It's like rain just flying over there. Oh, this is, where I need, this is why I need that unit of cavalry. I could just charge through and try and take out... Oh, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six... Seven units of slingers. Eight if you include the ones by the gate with their general. <laughs> they have no infantry. Where's their infantry gone? Or have they outwitted me? It wouldn't be surprised. Oh. Nope, that's the ones I just counted. Where's the infantry? I counted swordsmen and oathsworn earlier. Where are they gone? Nope, not over here. No ships or anything. That's, that's weird. I thought they had more infantry than this. Unless they've withdrawn or something for some re weird reason oh well it does not matter it will not deter us from our mission uh, the skirmishers are down to six they're gone but they come at me bro come on one two three four five six seven of them just sitting there skirmishing me I don't think I'm ever gonna lose a siege battle in this campaign <laughs> not unless I'm these units by here all get depleted and they keep attacking me turn by turn. Eventually they'll wear me down wear me down, but at the moment, I mean, come on. Right, all our skirmishers are expended, so I'm gonna bring them all down here. Bring them behind the wall. To the window. To the wall. Get your asses down there. No point being up there if they can't attack them. I could actually send them out. It would be a waste of skirmishers. I do want to keep them on my campaign map, so I don't exactly want to throw them away. I could, of course, recruit one or two mercenaries to replace them for the time being. I will need to charge them eventually. I can't just sit. Orders understood. Mind you, they are sending... They are getting completely battered. 29 out of 90. 78 out of 90. 34. Bows don't last forever. They've got to charge me. I know when they are. Look at this. <laughs> they've decided they've had enough. They're going to actually charge my phalanxes. I'm going to fast forward this because I want to see what happens and it looks like they were going to charge me they've just got a better better distance for themselves to be completely pummeled by my my tower oh I've lost the skirmish and troop up there it's not good but I can just sit here all day and let this happen they hardly they hardly landed a mark on me 72 sem uh, 59 24 of them, 78 of them, and 82 of them, so yeah, it should be pretty straightforward. I could just run out and charge them, but uh, is it worth it? I don't know. Oh, they are wrapped around my units. Yeah, I think it is worth it now. My Spartan hop the tays. Right, I'm not going to charge with everybody, I'm going to charge with only a few. One, two, three. Go foot, my boys. Charge them. Don't want to waste units because I probably have to defend the city again in the next part, in the next two, uh, end of turn phase. But we have routed the majority of them. They just come to my gates, and you can see all the dead bodies on the floor. Look at this, at the at the ladders as well. There's some dead bodies. But this is what I hate. There's three ladders here didn't get used. They could have outflanked me. They could have sent three units of O sworn up or something, taken the ladders, taken the tower, they held the defence there, and they got away in the city. But nope, didn't get that, did we? Oh well. It happened. What are these weird rings on the... I don't know if you guys can see it. There's weird rings right by there where the cursor is. Anyway, we've won. End the battle there. Heroic victory. I should think so too, although I didn't do much. <laughs> Even my units, my best unit was 104 kills from one of my slingers. 51. Hop the tail units. 7. 72. It does not matter. It matters not, as Yoda would say. They didn't even use their ballista, so I can't stand. No kills, didn't even use it. Would have been the perfect opportunity to use the ballista. But oh well. 
We're gonna kill them because they irritated me. That's their full stack done with. I could make a attempt for Sparta, I think. Military traditions, I should think so. General's increased in rank as well, he's a badass. Let's uh, hand out all the love. So what we got, we got spear arm to I wouldn't I'm gonna go for the missile this time because we we are gonna be defending a lot, I think. Armor for all units will help, we'll go for that. And we should go with campaign map movement, I think. Can we Well go for cunning when general, campaign map movement range when general. We'll go with that. And yeah, this army is replenishing. Look at that, a lot better now. I'm going to continue with the old recruitment while we're while we short on. We have lost a couple of slingers. I'll get one of them, one of the javelin, another Spartan hoplite, and another Perioikoi spearman. And I shall also recruit another general. So we will go with. Uh, we got Dapfis, royal family. He'll do. Raise the army. There we go. New general. I can start recruitment with him straight away. I'm going to give us some cavalry. We need good fighters. That's all I can recruit this turn. So we have defended Athens successfully. The mountain men of Tylus are nothing but two units. I could go for Sparta. I could go for Clarissa. Haven't decided yet. I will decide in the next part. But I've been Dragonheart. Hope you've all enjoyed. Until next time. Bye. <laughs>